good. So, molar flow and volumetric flow. In gases, there's a direct relationship. Uh, we're going to be using the ideal gas to relate them. Um, we're going to explain that a little bit further, but we can start using it right now just to see how it will be. Because in theory, you already know the ideal gas law. In liquids, you need to calculate the mass from the, let's say you have moles, calculate the molecular weight or get the molecular weight times mass. And if you have the density, you can go directly to volume. With ideal gas, it's a little bit more complex, but it's something about PV equals NRT. You want moles, it's something PBRT. Okay. What is the volumetric flow? If there are five moles of O2 passing per second, so that's already my flow rate, in one pipeline at this temperature, let's use ideal gas, you know, PV equals NRT, that's my ideal gas. Uh, let me pass the pressure dividing. You will have mole flow, R is a constant, temperature is a constant. And pressure is also data given. So 5 moles per second times the R I got from books or Wikipedia is 8.31 pascals cubic meters divided by mole Kelvin. Then my temperature, it must be in absolute gas. Please be sure to use absolute. And my pressure, which is one atmosphere. I know one atmosphere is 101,325 pascals. And I get this value, which is 0.12 cubic meters per second which I don't like that much. I prefer to say, change it to liters, and you say 122 liters per second. What's up guys? It's me, Chemical Engineering Guy. So if you liked the video, why not push the like button? It really helps me to know if you're liking the videos or if I should be changing something or I should be adding something, taking out content, whatever. Also, sharing is caring. So if you got any kind of friends, teachers, colleagues or whatever kind of person that might be interested in this type of content, why not share it? Sharing helps our community to grow faster in members and in content. If you want to keep track of my activity, videos, uploads, experiments, playlists, whatever content I'm getting on YouTube, be sure to click the subscribe button. Subscribing to the channel is totally free, guys. My dream is to create an online academy of chemical engineering, where everyone can access it in the world. Imagine a place in which the student, the teacher, and the engineer get the best of each other. Thank you, thank you, thank you guys for the support and the love.